Hey, what's going on YouTube family? I'm gonna do a 1300 mile review on this car that I've owned a few weeks. So far it's been pretty good. We only had a few issues with the dash where the maps decided to have a blank black screen. When I was trying to Google Home, the screen turned black and went load. So that's been like the only issue Another concern is definitely this dash. It gets really hot in the back by the, just the touch of it. And being in the Texas heat, I could see that being an issue. So definitely gonna have to use your sunshade as often as possible. But besides that, the electronics have been pretty cool. I was hoping maybe we'd get a little better, better mileage but right now we're still getting about the same as the the 2019 that I had that was a six speed. So we're getting like 21 miles to the gallon so far. Hopefully maybe it'll get better the more miles you put on it. But yeah, so far so good. Still liking the flat steering wheel. It's got a lot of good features, the seats. They've been uh, doing pretty well. I like how they hug you. Like the back, we've got the sunscreen. Definitely got to use that because everything gets hot in here, especially in the afternoon getting off of work. But yeah, it's going pretty, uh, it's been pretty good so far. Figured out how to do the remote rev. I'll show you that real quick, it's kind of cool. So that sounds pretty nice. We can go outside and do it. But so far, it's still an S550 with just the upgraded interior, I think. But still worth the money. Still like the wireless charger, because at least you're not always having cords hanging out. I like how I have the pull brake and not just the button, so it breaks up the center console because they also would just be filled up here and just a button. So that's a little bit nicer. Still like the interior on the door panels with the carbon fiber look, but I'll show you what it sounds like on the outside with the remote rev. the Corsa exhaust on the double X pipe and we're waiting on long tube headers to come in so we could try that but overall it's been it's been a pretty good car like the color flip-flops in the Sun in the in the shade so it's nice that it changes colors but overall it's been a good car no major <laughs> issues I like the grill part. I'm glad they made it bigger. The hood's functional, so you can actually see inside there. So that's nice that Ford did that. But overall, it's been, looks pretty good, stands out. The wheels look nice, but you can definitely tell you're gonna get a lot of brake dust on these, so you're gonna cost be cleaning them a lot. But got the windows tinted. That definitely helps out the heat. It makes it look better so it's not such a fishbowl. But yeah, overall, got 5% in the back. Got the coarse tips, black tips. But yeah, so far, so good. I still enjoy this car and look forward to many more mods and seeing how fast we can get.